Uh, she was about to refill some of the dog's treat stuffing toys for the day. But I am running low on treats. Usually this basket is full. We are, don't have any in that one. Just a few crumbs of liver and chicken in that one. We have mismatch oddballs. Some chickens. And somebody gave me these. The dogs don't really like them. That's why the bag is still pretty full. Because nobody really wants to eat them. It's more of a toy. All right, so we'll put all this back. We'll go inside and we'll make some dog treats today on this beautiful Saturday morning. I've had this dog treat cookbook for the longest time, so I decided to finally break it out and make a recipe. Uh, this one was pretty simple. It was just whole wheat flour, an egg, and some chicken broth. But just make sure it is the sodium-free chicken broth. Then you just mix it together. Pretty easy. Took some muscle, not gonna lie. It was a really thick dough, and then just had to knead it by hand after. Definitely gonna gain some muscle after after this. But it was easy enough to work with and clean up my little station, keep it clean. And then I was just trying to break off uh, kibble sized pieces, um, small enough to, to stuff into the treat stuffing toys and give Lilic a piece and Oscar too. But just little pieces. You could have done bigger ones and done cookie cutouts, but didn't need to. Preheat the oven to 350 and pop those bad boys in for about 20 minutes. Not too long. So we'll, we'll get those cooking and we'll come back and check on them. Looking good. I also decided, you know what? I have a dehydrator, I have sweet potato, I have carrot. You know what? The dogs like both. Let's try two. Make some carrot and sweet potato chips for the dogs. Because we bougie. Let's feed our dogs vegetables and make them healthy, right? <laughs> so I decided to, to slice those up. I had a lot. I decided to soak them in some, some chicken broth to give them some, some flavor because I didn't know if the dogs would eat them without them. Hey. All right, I had to put all the sweet potato and the carrots in the dehydrator. But sweet potato is great for dogs. It's, you know, a great source of vitamin A and it promotes healthy skin, coat, eyes, even nerves and muscles. It you know, even has vitamin C, B6, potassium, calcium, iron. I could keep going on. It's, it's great. My dogs love sweet potato. Even carrots. Carrots are great too, full of vitamin A and you know, boosts the immune system. It's good for their their skin, their their coat. Oh geez, okay, we're on chicken now. I was talking about carrots. I had some leftover chicken, it was about to go bad, so I decided to throw that in the dehydrator as well. But chicken's obviously good for dogs, but so is carrots and potatoes.
You guys want to try some new treats? It's almost dropped them. Oh, okay, not my finger though. You guys are greedy. Ah! Okay, do you want to try one? Right there. Yum. Irie, Sansa, you guys want to try some treats? You want to try it? There, you'll eat it. See? Good stuff, huh, guys? Chandler, you can't take it out of her mouth. That's it. You guys can have some more later. I had some leftover ingredients and some pumpkin puree that was about to go bad, so I decided to make a few more treats. This one's pretty simple. It was just wheat flour, pumpkin puree, and an egg. And I had these really cute cookie cutters that I found in a box because you know, we're still unpacking. Um, so I decided to, to use these. So I got little puppies that I'm cutting out and some bones and a bigger shepherd too. So it'll be nice to have some, some bigger treats to stuff in some toys. Because the other treats the dogs seemed to like, but they were a little small. So here are some bigger ones. You want some? There's a lot in Oh, Chandler, wait your turn. That's what you get. Oh, these ones are popular. All right, Frenchies. Here you go. Good. Hold on. You got pumpkin on your face. Oh, here you go. Here you go. Okay. Good stuff. I'd say two paws up. That's it. Well, it's now the next morning and it's extremely cold. Spring is over and we're back into winter. But we did our morning hike and now we're in the run. And I thought I would try out the treats and see if anybody likes them. So far, nobody cares, but let's, let's, let's try them out. Let's see if anybody likes our treats. Anybody want a treat? Grindy, I see you're looking at it. You wanna try some? Oh, just take a bite. Hey, just, it's supposed to be just a bite. Well, Grindy liked it. You want one? Hey, hold on. I'm gonna break this one in half. This is for August. Get out of here, Grindy. Oh. Juvia, you want to try? I take that as a yummy, yummy. And the chicken jerky ones turned out pretty well too. They're all dry now. Let's see if they like them. Oh, they're gonna like them. It's chicken. What dog doesn't like chicken? Tatum, you want one? Tatum, Aswa. We, oui. bon, good. Oh, you've come back for another? Okay. What do you think? Maple sip? There you go. The last treats I bought out were the, the first ones we baked. All right, let's see. Oh, you're gonna be a tester, aren't you? You gonna sit? You gotta sit. Maple, you gonna sit? Grundy. Juvia. Juvia. Ball is life. Too important. Who's going to get the left? <laughs> well, I mean, I guess she is French, right? 
Okay, say bye.